Welcome everybody, this is your boy Dryden Matoro and we are here with another video. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more content and we're going to get straight into the video. Welcome back everybody, before we do get straight into the video, I would like to give a big shout out and thank you to the supporters of this YouTube channel. A big shout out to Crazy Boss V31, Weez G and Z Gaming, and even Moldy Superman YT. Now these people are our YouTube members on our YouTube platform and I really do appreciate their support. So why don't you go inside my description below and go and check them out and we're going to get straight into the video. Now this video is all about on how to install Simeon Records mod inside your Grand Theft Auto V folder. So like always make sure that you download and install all of the latest requirements that's inside my description below. Once you have completed that process then download this mod and I will leave this mod inside my description below. Now this mod does have requirements so you must download enable all interiors and I will leave this inside my description below and lastly download lemon UI and I will leave this inside my description below as well so let's get started now once you have finished downloading all of your files go to your Grand Theft Auto V game hover over it right click and open file location now before we do get started Go to your skotogv.net.ini file and make sure that you change your reload key to insert. Next, go to your scripts folder and make sure that you do spell scripts correct and make sure it is all lowercase. Open up your scripts folder. As you can see, my scripts folder is completely empty. So let's get started. Firstly, open up your Lemon UI Extract folder, go to your SHVDN2 folder, select all the files and drag it inside your scripts folder. Go back to your Extract folder and go to SHVDN3 folder. Now this is optional, you don't have to do it, but select all the files and now drag it inside your scripts folder. Now exit out of your extract folder. Next, open up your enable all interiors extract folder. And now there will be another folder inside there. Just go and open up that folder and your skits folder. Now select all the files and folder and drag it inside your skits folder. And exit out of your extract folder. Now lastly, open up your Simeon Records extract folder. Open up this one and this one and now select all the files except for the readme.txt and now drag it inside your scripts folder. That's all you got to do. Now you can delete this if you want to. It's totally up to you. You don't need that. Now once you have finished with that, go back to your extract folder, exit out of your extract folder. Go back to your main Grand Theft Auto V folder, right click, refresh your game folder, exit out of your game folder, right click, refresh your desktop, and I will see you guys in the game. And now we are back in the game and our game did not crash. Now I better just let you guys know one thing, okay? Now you don't really need enable all interiors, but I always use enable all interiors. So anyways guys, let's get straight into it. So. To make this mod work, you'll need to go and steal a vehicle. Now, it will be a while, okay? So, let's just go and enable our interiors, okay? Go enable interiors, then go to your menu, go right down to the bottom. Then now, uh, load MP maps, true. Enable blips, true. And now, uh, random colors blips, true, which is optional. Now, refresh interior, wait for a few seconds, back out of your menu, 
and now press insert on your keyboard. Now your game will freeze for only a few seconds. Then there you go. Now you'll need to go and steal a vehicle. So technically the vehicle is basically around the Los Santos customs. Now usually the vehicles are around the customs. So let's go and see if we can find a vehicle. Let's go over here. Does Simeon need this car? Nope. So let's go and steal another car. Let's try this one. Now there will be a message popping up on your screen that Simeon needs that car. So what I'm going to do okay is that this is going to take a while to find the, find the right vehicle. Is this it? No. Wait. Okay. So, um, okay, guys, I'm gonna pause the video and I will show you guys once I found a vehicle, okay? And now we're back again, guys. So, it took me a long time to try and find that right vehicle, but I got the vehicle now, and um, yeah, and it actually works. So, what I gotta do is that I had to take the vehicle to the Los Santos Customs. And now I've got to take it to Simeon. So here we go. So I'm going to take it to the customs. Um, take, it, take it to the customs. Over here. And now all I've got to do is just only respray the vehicle. And now there will be another uh, prompt coming up on my screen. Uh, okay, let's go and repair and respray. I'm just going to make uh, like a normal record color. Um, I don't know, yellow. There you go. Now, it will say on my screen that Simeon, this record is ready for Simeon, so deliver it to him. And when you go on the map, he will be right down the bottom over here. So let's go over there. And now we are nearly there. So let's go over here. And it's about I think over here. Yep. And now deliver the vehicle to him. There you, there you go. go. And now it's all done. Now this mod really is a really good mod. It brings online to story mode. So there you go. You got your pay. And now you can go and steal more vehicles. So the mod does work 100%. There's no errors or no issues. So I hope you guys do enjoy this mod. And we're back again. So I hope you guys do enjoy the mod. That mod is an awesome mod. But like always, if you guys do get stuck installing this mod, then please let me know in the comments and I'll be more than welcome to help you out on that. Or if you do get stuck installing any other mods, then please let me know in the comments and I'll be more than welcome to help out on that. Now, if you guys do want fast reply, then join my Discord server. I will leave my Discord server inside my description below. So go and check that out. So with that all said, if you guys did enjoy this video or if this video was helpful, then smash that like button and subscribe for more content and tutorials. And I will see you all on my next video. Thank you for watching, peace, and I'm out.